charging a lens. So as is explained before, first we align the optical axis of the lens with the mechanical axis of the lens using the two cups uh, and the rotational spindle and uh, we use a laser to get reflection from the top surface and we rotate the whole uh, i mean the two cups and the lens together and after that we can say the mechanical axis of the this spindle is aligned with the optical axis of the lens then for uh, eight, uh, for grinding process we have a grinding wheels that goes up and down and when it approach the edge of the lens and again moving up and down we can actually grind the edge of the lens as you can see in this uh, animation the aging, uh, the grinding wheel uh, which is a diamond coated grinding wheel goes up and down it, which is very important because uh, when the lens and the spindle is rotating precisely and as i mentioned the mechanical axis of the lens is aligned to the optical axis of the lens it doesn't matter that the mechanical axis of the spindle is precise or not because it's just going up and down and then you can make a flat uh, cylinder at the edge and the cylinder that covers this edge the center of the cylinder that covers this edge should remain aligned with the mechanical axis of this rotational spindle the machine that is used in this process is a precise automated CNC centering machine and most of the time they use two diamond coated grinding wheels in order to speed the operation as you can see in this photo this is a diamond coated grinding wheel is a commercial one so now let's talk about the sequence of operation in edging centering and beveling a typical double concave lens so a double concave lens is a lens that has two surfaces front and back it's concave as, as you can see in this photo we in it for i mean a typical mounting double concave lens we need to have two cylinders on these edges two cylinders and we should have three flat uh, bevels on the bottom in between and the top and also we need to have three protective bevels on the edges at 45 degrees these two edges uh, i mean the top edge this one and this one now we should talk about the sequence of making this kind of i mean as an example this kind of um, uh, double concave lens on the grinding uh, lens centering and grinding machine so again you know we have one flat surf flat bevels on the bottom on the top and in between and we have two optic uh, two cylindrical surfaces and three protective bevels the reason that they put different colors is that you know the sequence of each of them is different than the others so we show them with three different colors so here as you can see for the first step first we make two cylinders uh, at the edge of the lens here and here and one flat uh, surface on the top so the first step two grinding wheels approaches the lens and make it like this two uh, cylinders and one flat surface and for the second step the grinding the grinding wheels goes to the top and make one flat and here we have the two uh, cups that holds the lens that I explained it in the uh, previous lesson we make the top surface flat and bottom surface flat and for making a a protective bevels this grinding wheel goes at 45 degrees move like this so in this way you can make a protective bevel at this edge and then the next step because these grinding wheels are at 45 degrees as you can see we can make one protective bevel on this edge and one pro protective bevels at 45 degrees on this edge and uh, finish the whole process of grinding centering and edging a double concave lens thank you very much